Welcome back troglodytes to Would You Rock or Not. Today we're going to take a look at a PRS that caught my eye while I was looking for new guitars. This is a private stock PRS and that's pretty much like the custom shop in Gibson terms where they just use the very nicest woods available to create some really knockout guitars. It has a very heavily quilted two piece maple top. And it looks like most things that are usually plastic are wooden on this example, similar to like a The Les Paul. Now this guitar is made of some really exotic woods. You have a Coca-Bolo neck and fingerboard with ivory inlay birds, as well as African ribbon mahogany back. Even the case itself is fairly fantastic looking. PRS definitely knows how to dress a guitar up. As mentioned earlier, all plastic parts have been made out of wood, but look at those back plates. Very similar wood as the front, and the neck has a lot of interesting wood grain to it. The peak at the top from the inside is also very interesting in the control cavity. And here again is a beautiful shot at a heavily quilted back plate. One small flaw that this guitar does have is despite being a really high-end guitar, apparently PRS drilled this guitar in the wrong area for the bottom strap button, and the owner had to fix this. You can see it definitely was not put centered originally. This one is for sale by Johnny Rocks Guitars, and he lives in Tampa, Florida, so if you're interested in it, feel free to check it out on Reverb. The only question left? Would you rock this PRS private stock guitar or not? Leave your answer down in the comment section below, and regardless of how you feel about this instrument, please like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you tomorrow on the next episode. Take care.